evening, everybody. I hope you're all having a wonderful evening in the comfort of your homes or offices. My name is Vinod Siani. I'm the CEO at Educate Me Group. Uh, I'm joining you and presenting from London, United Kingdom, people. Hopefully, I will uh, be able to welcome you one day to London. We're going to take you through a study abroad seminar with our partners, Schema Business School in France, uh, based in Europe. For those of you perhaps who's not sure where France may be. Right, a um, couple of house rules first. Uh, we will have questions and answers at the very end. If you have any questions you want to ask, please do raise your hand in Zoom you have an ability to actually put your hand up uh, using one of the icons, and then that will tell us that you have a question. And then you can use the chat to actually answer, ask your question. If you want to do audio, please can I ask you to wait to the end once the seminars have been completely finished, and then we can open up for Q&A. First, I will be your presenter and taking you through Educate Me Group and what we do as an agency to help with your applications to Schema Business School in France. And then we will hand it over to Schema Business School, who will then take us through an introduction about themselves and why should you join Schema Business School in France. Okay, so the two of us holding hands are here to help you with any inquiries that you may have, and we will look to make sure that your inquiry from you. Our counselors' information, uh, contact details will all be shared with you towards the end. And then that way you will have all the information then to move forward, okay? And make your decisions as to how you want to go. Right, we have our IT team who are in the background who will move our screens forward for us. Uh, thank you, IT. Please go ahead, move to the next screen. Right, Educate Me, who are we? Educate Me is a UK-based educational organization that provides consultancy to students across the globe. Primarily, we're rounded support for learners of all stages of international study, and that's me at the little bottom, handsome picture of me at the back. Thank you very much. Next, please. What do we do? Our aim is to make education, make quality education more accessible to students across the globe. That's what we are, that's what we want to do and what we want to, what we're great at. Next, please. Here is just a handful of awards and recognitions. Of course, we always like to share and boast about all of the good things that we do. So we are part of Pearson's accredited, we are business award finalists for 2023 and 2024. And then a couple of badges at the bottom of who we're also accredited by OET, Occupational English Test. If any of you were interested in nursing, for example, or healthcare, that's an exam that you have to do. We are already accredited to take that exam. ICEF is an organization that accredits quality agents. So we've already gone through that process. And British Council, uh, all of you must be aware of, Language Cert is an alternative English test to IELTS and uh, Pearson's, okay? Thank you. Next, please. What are the benefits? Educate Me is just one of a very few organizations that actually help with employment opportunities. And in the UK, although they are conducting help across, across the globe, in the UK, we are actually collaborated with an organization called Student Circus, and many universities are collaborated with them, but just a handful of agents, including us. And our job is to link you with them and giving you a free opportunity to actually get employment whilst you're studying. Not a lot of, uh, not a lot of agencies actually have that benefit. And believe it or not, it's free, okay? But you can only do it through accredited universities or agents like us. It's not available as a buy-on product, okay? Um, we don't charge for our services. So if you have an inquiry and not sure what to do next, 
we will help you with our counseling, with our profiling of universities and documents, and all of that help is given to you with zero charge, okay? We are also partnered with One Vasco VFS. VFS is the middle body that works with the Indian government and the governments in Europe and United Kingdom. So they are the middle body that actually handles your visa application, okay? They're a giant organization. They work with around 88 governments and in a year, uh, do around about 12 million visa applications, okay? And again, we're collaborating with them. It just goes to show um, how ethical we are, how honest we are, and how professional we are. Next, please. Okay, welcome to Schema Business School. I'll now hand over the slides to Sripna Emini. Over to Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, and I'm very, very sorry for my late. I had a... <laughs> IT issues, so unfortunately it arrived. So uh, thank you for your presentation. It was very, very clear and it was wonderful. So thank you very much. Just to present myself, my name is Shpre Saimini. I am um, work for Schema Business School for almost five years now. And I'm in charge, of course, to develop our agent network for Schema Business School. And actually, uh, Schema is working approximately with uh, 80 agents all around the world who helps us to develop our brand uh, in their countries and to recruit the best profiles for Schema, of course, and for all our campuses. So I will make a short presentation to Schema and for the MSc programs. And of course, my colleague uh, from international department joined also uh, with me. So for all the students or persons who has uh, uh, questions about accommodation, because it's a very important question for all international students, Lorian will be able to answer to this question and to guide students uh, not to make mistakes uh, when they are looking for uh, accommodation. So I'm going to make a short presentation. Uh, of course, you can send your questions in the chat or in the end of my presentation, you can um, ask all the questions you may have about our MSc programs. So do not hesitate. I have my colleague Viragi, who is with me uh, also. She will also answer to all the questions you, or you may have. So I'm going to try to send my presentation. It's up. Do you see my presentation? Yes, we can. So as may you know, uh, Schema is a French business school based in uh, three campuses uh, in France, in north in France, Italy, uh, in Paris, of course, and in south of France in Sofia Antipolis. And we have campuses in uh, Raleigh in United States, Belo Horizonte in Brazil, uh, in China, in Suzhou, and uh, South Africa uh, in Stellenbosch. And starting from this fall 2024, uh, we will have a new campus based in Dubai, when, uh, which the students will be able to join from January uh, 2025. So uh, Schema, it's a French private business school. Uh, and it exists approximately uh, since uh, 15 years. So uh, we recruit students from all around the world for French or international English uh, program. A few is uh, not, it's not this. Uh... Okay, so it's here. So this figures about schema. Uh, we have approximately um, 10,000 uh, students uh, coming from all around the world uh, studying in our campuses. Uh, more than 45, I would say 50% of students are international now. And uh, of course, uh, that can go and if they wish to go to study in our nine campuses. I will show you the map of all the campuses where Schema is based. In China, they can go approximately three campuses today. 
to study BBA, Master in Management, or Master of Science program. I was talking to my colleague Imali, which I'm always in contact today. We will only focus to the MSc programs, uh, of course. I will uh, just make the presentation of Master of Science program and our uh, um, application process, because this is very, very important to explain to everybody our, um, uh, our process, because it's not the same for all the programs. But I will send to Himali, to my colleague, this presentation. So maybe she can also send to her partners uh, for the partners who need the presentation of uh, of our school. The accreditation and awards. This is a um, schema has accreditation, international accreditations, French accreditations, and just uh, to to to. It's very important to know that all our master programs deliver a master degree programs which is uh, recognized by the ministry of Edu french education as i was saying this is where we are based you see you united states we are also in canada but in canada students cannot go to study it's only um artificial it's a resource and research center for in artificial intelligence so this is where we are based in all uh countries and of course, uh, all, all our academic partners, because for some programs, students are uh, allowed to make one semester in uh, French schema campuses. And the second semester, sometimes in some cases, students can go to study if they wish to our partners university. So it gives you an idea which country our partnerships exist. So this is the portfolio uh, of all the programs of Schema Business School. Of course, students can start to join Schema from our after high school to join for the global BBA because the Indian students most of the time uh, applies for global BBA for mastery management. A program in English, and of course for our um, MSc uh, Master of Science, Master of Science three year and Master of Science one year. The students who are doing this program it depends from the eligibility and the professional experience that students may have. Of course, they can go until a Global Executive MBA and PhD. Uh, Tell me if you prefer to have questions now or maybe in the end of my presentation, or you can put also questions in your chat and Viragi will, will uh, give a feedback to everybody. So we will go direct to our MSc uh, programs. Uh, as I was speaking with my colleague Himali, we will focus in our MSc, uh, or in our MSc uh, Master of Science. So students coming from India, most of the time applies a lot for the Master of Science two year and for one year uh, students that can apply are students who have four years bachelor and three years of professional experience. Uh, it's came up for students who are doing a master two year program, they have the possibility to have a double degree at schema and I would say that today we are one of the only maybe three school, a business school in France can deliver this kind of degree. That means that you will have a master in management degree and of course, um, special uh, and a diploma, what we call DESMI in, uh, in English. So in the end, you can ask all the questions. As you can see, all the programs are a master degree delivered by the Ministry of Education uh, of French Education. So the Master of Science is 100% in English. Uh, students uh, have to do this program in full time. Uh, for example, for students who are going to join the program in September, they will have courses until the end of the April. And after the students, will go to do internship, four or six months of internship. Um, and in the end of the master, the students must do a dissertation to validate uh, this program. For students, of course, the internship is mandatory. No internship, they cannot get a diploma. So I invite students in the end of the studies to start very, very fast to, to, to look for an internship. They are allowed to do the internship in France, or abroad. So this is, for example, the first year uh, courses that are given to the students for September session 
think for the spring session because some programs are also open in January session. And so they can student approximately will have these courses and the different tracks for the first year. So um, I will let you, you can find this same information also in our website and also in um, in our uh, in our brochures. So uh, schema for the Master of Science, we have four big field, I would say. The first field is the business and strategy. And as you can see in my presentation, this is a program that are given in this field in business uh, in business and strategy. For this, you have the name of the programs, you have the ranking, you have the program where the program you can follow in which copies of schema. And if the program is double degree with a for, with a, with another university, for example, if we take entrepreneurship and design for sustainability, uh, you will see that you will uh, the first semester in Sofia Antipolis, which is south of France. The second semester, you can go to uh, make your program in Milano. For example, for the entrepreneurship and technology, you will do Sofia after San Francisco in United States. Of course, all the students that have to go to, um, to study in another campus, in another university, uh, Lorian will after answer how, because you need a visa, of course. Uh, so we will answer in the end of the presentation to all, this, um, all these questions. The second field is finance. Uh, so you have uh, four programs in finance, corporate finance, financial management, auditing, sustainable finance and fintech. And of course, our uh, excellent pro excellence program, which is financial markets and investment. So this year we are uh, ranked third uh, worldwide financial times. So I will change my presentation. So students can uh, study this program in three campuses, Paris, Sophie Antipolis and Raleigh, United States. I will give you at the end of the presentation the eligibility uh, for, for, for each program. So the third field is management. So uh, I would say uh, we have a lot of uh, Indian students who comes to study project management and global supply chain uh, at Schema Business School. And of course, uh, most of the time, they come also to make a triple master, uh, which you see here. It's a, a free diploma in the same time, which allows students to study in three different countries. Uh, at Yoloya, Loyola in United States, uh, at Schema, of course, for the Master in Management program. And uh, the student will finish uh, with uh, LMU in uh, Munich in Germany. And of course, uh, this program is in collaboration with MIT uh, for the Master Global Supply Chain. The last field it's of course uh, the field of marketing uh, so you can see the programs uh, which the student can choose for this field and of course uh, the, the different um, university partners where the student can go to, to study. Um, I will just make a focus for example for the global look management I say to my partners, you have to be very, very careful with this program because this is an excellence program. We have 60 places per year um, for this program. So we have approximately 450 applications and uh, applications are closing in February. And we have only one intake, which is the September intake. It's in collaboration with New York University, the first uh, semester students uh, goes immediately. They start from New York University, and after from January session, they have to join Paris uh, campus until April, and after, of course, to make an internship for six months of internship to validate the 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 diploma. So you have to to be be careful if you want really to join this uh, this program. You have to apply very early uh, in the year and we accept only the best applicants uh, for this program. So do you have any question about all these MSc programs? No question, that's good. <laughs> so 
Um, just to show you the employability a little bit for the uh, MSc programs, you have here some K figures. Uh, we took four programs. You can see uh, the rate of the employability, the average of the salary, and after you have the recruiting companies uh, that recruit students uh, from this program. Um, I would say that uh, students, we have two, uh, approximately two or three events per year uh, where the companies come in our campus and recruit students for internship and sometimes, of course, uh, for the first, uh, for the first uh, job. Um, so this is the eligibility of uh, and criteria to join a master in a master of science at Schema Business School. So you can see here uh, that uh, most of the most of the time students apply after three years of bachelor. That means they are going to join a two year uh, program, and. A four-year program, it's one-year MSc. Only in some cases, and especially with the Indian bachelor uh, students, with a four-year bachelor, they must justify three years of professional experience to join our one-year program. Uh, this is not schema rules. This is an agreement between Ministry of uh, Education of India and France. So uh, please, you just be careful when you apply because all the applications that are a four-year bachelor or three-year bachelor and no uh, three-year of professional experience, unfortunately, we must uh, refuse them. But all my par uh, partners knows that already. So normally, we will not have a, a problem of application. So uh, in this test, uh, we don't need for Indian students, of course. Uh, so you can see also a uh, tuition fees uh, for year or for one year. Uh, it can change for any program. For example, uh, the, the tuition fees are not the same for all the programs. And of course, students must pay 100 euro of uh, application fees. This is very important, uh, the application fees, uh, we don't exempt, uh, but uh, for the students who register at Schema and uh, come to study at Schema, we, uh, we will refund this 100 euro or deduct, sorry, from uh, the total of your tuition fees. You can find, of course, you must do your application online. It's not necessary to send us all the documents or uh, your transcript, you must uh, mandatory apply um, online. So as I was saying, we have a talent and career who helps our student to find an internship, to guide students, uh, to make the CV, the um, motivation letter. Uh, so do not hesitate when you are in the campus to go to see this department and they will guide you, make uh, to you maybe um, interview to prepare you to see a company uh, and to find a, an internship. Don't, I say always to my students, don't wait the last minute to do that. You must do that immediately when you come and you join and when you know in which uh, field you want to work, you must start, you, you must, uh, start your research for your internship uh, very, very early. Uh, what about, of course, you can have an application in your phone. Uh, I'll just make a focus in um, how many times it takes to do an application uh, in, um, in um, I will try to change up, up, my presentation. So um, application process, uh, it takes approximately, it depends when you start your application. For example, uh, now for the January session, uh, we start to receive application, but for students who will start to apply at o October, November, just be careful because uh, courses will start the first week of January and you have to do your application visa, which will take approximately between uh, six and eight weeks. Uh, so earlier you do your application, 
earlier you will have your interview and you'll receive all the documents uh, to do your process, uh, to do your visa. You can see here what is approximately application process from the day when you uh, send your application and until the registration, because you have, I would say three main process, the application, we will check the application to see if everything is okay, if student is eligible for the program. If everything is okay, we will send to the student um, in a link for the interview. Student must confirm the interview. You will do the interview with the program di director approximately 20 minutes. And after you will receive a notification about your admission. If you are admitted, you will have the last process of your uh, application process it's the registration that's mean to sign the contract and to pay your uh, deposit which is 5000 euro and in after that you will receive all the documents about your visa you can see here what i was saying retro planning and areas to focus on the day when you send all uh, your documents we have to check all your documents uh, please uh, just uh, download the documents in the right way because sometimes we, we receive application which are not good. Sometimes uh, the transcript, transcripts are missing and until your application is not complete, we will not proceed to any interview. So from the day one till the registration, it can take approximately 21 days. And I would say the special points to focus on, um, put your dates uh, of your experience in your CV. It's very important because we will check the years of the experience that you have in your CV. Um, uh, sometimes it's not always. I know that you students applies for different schools, but that's normal. Uh, but sometimes you are using the same motivation letter. So sometimes, at Schema, we receive motivation letters from for uh, for uh, UM Lyon or Neoma. Be careful. I will not uh, say nothing, but for the program director, it's very important to see that the student took a time to write a motivation letter. And please, I would ask to my partner, sometimes I receive the same motivation letter for, letter for 10 students. Don't forget that we read the motivation letter. So it's very, very important to focus on this uh, on this kind of um, uh, things. So this is approximately uh, important uh, really to, to download the correct and the right documents for, uh, for the application. Do you have a question? Uh, merci, Kipra. Thank you very much. Thank you. That was uh, magnifique. <laughs> merci, merci. You speak French? <laughs> I don't, I don't, I don't. I know a couple of words, a couple of words. Mm. Um, thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, we yes. will open up to questions uh, shortly. I yes. just want to rephrase, Shipra, please, that yes. we should encourage all of our applicants who are here that if they are interested in making applications, they should go through us in the first instance. We will help all of the individuals ensure that they've got the correct profile set of documents. And, and thereafter, we will then engage the students with yourself. Um, mm -hmm. I think that's just an important note to make. All right. But uh, yes, uh, are we open to questions now? I will have also my colleague uh, Lorian, who will make a small presentation about the um, about the accommodation. It's very important to give this information to 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 your candidates because this is a big big a uh, big important thing for for Indian students. Uh, just not to make mistakes that some did this year. And we don't want to put students in difficulties when they come to France because we had one or two students that uh, were in difficulties this year because they booked their accommodation uh, in uh, some, uh, some um, I would say, platform. 
and unfortunately uh, they had bad surprises. So uh, it's not our goal to put students in the difficulties. Uh, our main mission is to guide them. And so um, this is very important to hear what my colleague Lorian has to say. And after I will answer all the questions. Hello everyone, so I'm Lorian Saison. I work uh, for the housing department at Schema Business School. Um, I help students uh, find accommodation on the three French campuses, Paris, Lille, and Sofia Antipolis. And um, I would say the first thing to look at is the budget for accommodation, um, because you will need money to have a housing in France. Um, in Paris, it will be around 800 euros per month the accommodation in Lille and Sofia Antipolis a bit less, around 700, and in Lille around 550 or 600 euros per month. Um, it's important to plan that budget because if you don't have it, you will uh, focus on you know what you will eat rather than on your studies, and that's not the point here. The point is that you succeed in your studies and don't have to worry about other things, let's say. Um, so I would say planning the budget ahead is really important. Um, and um, for most consulates in India, uh, you will need to actually have uh, housing booked to apply for, for visa. So actually, once you have completed the application process, as Shpesa explained, um, you will need to find accommodation as soon as possible in order to request the visa. So that means you have another, you know, days um, before you can actually request a visa and then some weeks in order to get it before the intake. So you need to take uh, that time also into consideration. Um, so once the student is uh, registered, we send out uh, information about housing, about where to live around campuses. Uh, we send links of our partners, uh, like partnerships that we have to help you. And um, we reply, you know, every day, like every night when we leave the office, all emails are answered. Um, so if you have any doubt about the contract, about the housing, um, please don't hesitate to contact us and we will help you. Um, note that two, like, two low prices in a good area does not exist, especially in Paris, and there are a lot of scams. So on this case, please and do not hesitate to contact us so that we check if it's not a scam or not, because as Shpresa explained, every year, unfortunately, we have students without housing because they paid people who were scammers. Um, and the goal is to find housing um, quite early. Um, so if we are talking about the January intake, the best time to book would be early November, I would say. And uh, because if you wait until January, um, then there will no longer be housing left. So you really need to anticipate um, that as well. Um, I don't know. Maybe they have questions. Yes, if you have questions, don't hesitate. I see there is already a question, but uh, I think for you. Thank you. So our IT team, if I can ask you now, please, to unmute everybody. It's our IT, our wonderful IT team. They have the controls for everything. Okay. Uh, thank you, Alifia. So thank we've you. just shared the contact details of all of our counselors there. And we are now ready uh, for questions. Can I ask you, please, to put your hands up first? And then we can take questions in order. Okay, thank you very much. So raise your hands. Thank you. Look, we have graphics for everything here. Yeah, hi. Uh... Ronak here from Ahmedabad, India. Just wanted to uh, know that. Could you please uh, share the credentials which you shared the slide? Yes, of course. I'm going to send it to my colleague uh, Imali. I don't know if he's here uh, or to my colleague uh, uh, Viragi, but for sure I will send to Imali and uh, we will uh, send you this. No problem. No problem. And you can use that, of course. Um, thank you. Ronak, can I just say the video recording of this presentation will actually be up on our website uh, mm -hmm. by tomorrow. Yes, Great. of course. No problem. So you can actually go through this. And if there's anything you need to double check, you can always kind of go backwards, forwards, etc. So Great. Sounds good. Just wanted to thank Educate Me Group. Uh, I'm sincerely interested to go ahead with this organization because of the accreditation. 
and mm-hmm. just want to share that i'm aware about french language also so thank you so much uh, we'll connect soon merci right. Thank Merci. Thank you, Ronak. Yes, of course, all the students will have uh, French courses. Uh, it's two hours per week. And I encourage students to, to learn French. You will need in your daily life uh, to, to, to speak French. So, of course, you will have a French language during your academic year. Yes, of course. Hopefully, yes. <laughs> if I'm you are perfect. motivated to learn, but I'm pretty okay. sure you are motivated to learn. And we recommend to learn French to find internship and jobs because that's really important in France and if you want to stay in France later. Yes, I have a query here. Uh, yes. Does Schema Business School um, take students only on memorandum of instructions or English proficiency test is mandatory? Um, this, uh, the it, it depends uh, how uh, maybe Viragi can answer to this question because she is also uh, following the, um, the process of Indian students. Uh, normally, student Viragi, you are there? Uh, yes, I'm there. So normally students who have studied throughout in English medium, you know, I mean, which is normally the case with Indian students, you know, their high school, their universities. And when we talk to them, we understand. So we do not make it mandatory for Indian students who have studied in uh, English medium throughout who land up speaking fluent uh, English to have the IELTS or TOEFL score with us. If in case during the interview we have a question, then we we get back to them, uh, you know, and we have our own in-house uh, English test uh, proficiency. Uh, you know, we invite them. It's a free of charge. Uh, you know, that's a very rare case, just one or two percent where we have a doubt. But normally it's not required for Indian students. We exempt them from English uh, proficiency test. Okay. Also, uh, just a question on that. What is the English scores they require in order to be exempt from 10th and 12th standard? What do they need? No, no English. No, nothing. We don't expect anything. You know, so if they have studied in English medium throughout, which is normally the case in the universities. So, it, you know, in, there's a memorandum of, uh, in, uh, there's a medium of instruction English uh, document, and that's about it. Okay. Only in case of doubts, because, you know, we have a personal interview with the program director for 30 minutes. And only if he has a doubt very, very rarely, then we do not reject the student. We, we get back to the student that we might have a little doubt and we would like you to go through an English test, which is only 20 minutes and we send the invitation to them very rarely. And I, I, I will just maybe add this. I know that when students come to France, sometimes they don't, maybe they are shy and they don't come to see us often in our offices or all our team. I just uh, want to, to say to students, if you have a problem or you need a question or you need help, you have to come to see any team, any department uh, in the school, that's very important. Don't stay because you don't want to disturb. No, you don't disturb us. We are here for students. We are here to guide you to to to, to do your academic year. So uh, please uh, don't hesitate to come and to see us, to call Viragi, to call me, to call other person in our uh, team. We are here to listen to students, to guide them. So uh, you don't disturb us. Thank you, thank you. I mean, very important, very important. We always yeah. hear, we always hear, sadly, of students um, who don't know where to go, who to no, go. No, that's mm, um, no. And it's always important, and these things are always addressed at mm. orientation week, where yes. a number of departments will come and say hello, and give you an insight as to what their department does, where they are, and how they can help you. Mm. All sorts of things, accommodation, yes. very important, employment opportunities, where can you go to volunteer or to get help? Mm. If you're interested yeah. in uh, medical, who do I go to if I want to register for a doctor? All of these things are common questions, and it's absolutely right. The students need to be signposted to the correct departments, and they should not be shy at all. Mm. 
And, and no, really, that's very important. And when you come to Paris or any uh, any uh, campus, I put in touch uh, new students with uh, students. They will finish so they can uh, give you some tips uh, important to, to, to finish your academic year uh, without having problems. So that's very important. So you have to come to see us. Don't stay just, I don't want to disturb. I don't know where to go. In the beginning of the year, the first week, the international department will make a presentation and will give you all the important informations about, uh, for example, uh, permit stay in France, how do you do, uh, how many times you have to validate your visa when you come to France. So that's very important because if you don't do this uh, administrative uh, thing when you come to France, you will be in a irregular situation after. So it will be, it can be dangerous for you. So this is very important information to follow. If we do this uh, meetings, if we do this webinars, it's to give you all the information uh, to have to, to, to have your beautiful experience uh, with your studies when you go to study in one country. So uh, for Schema, I can say that uh, all the departments will uh, receive students if you have any question or any problem or you have to come to see us. Thank you very much. Thank you. Um, are there any questions? There is one message uh, from somebody called Ria. I wanted to know about the bachelor's programs in Schema Business School. Oh yes, of course. Uh, I would, I would just maybe share my presentation in just in the beginning to show you the bachelor's yeah, program. Uh, hi, it's me, uh, Ria. I wanted to know about uh, the bachelor's program related to uh, business. It's a BBA and a BCom, especially. Of course, the BBA program schema, it's a four year program. I will share my uh, application. Uh, my uh, so, uh, Ria, I didn't make mistake. So, um, the this is a, the bachelor of uh, of schema. We'll just see if I global BBA. So it's a four-year bachelor. Uh, the bachelor is not, uh, we cannot study in Paris. You have to go to Lille or to Sofia Antipolis. Uh, two years, it's 100% in English. You can do this program in all our campuses of Schema. There is 13 specialization. And of course there is two intake, September and, uh, and January. Uh, so you can see where is our uh, our uh, bachelor, and you can also from September 2022, you can also do two year in France, and you can go two year in Barcelona with our uh, university partner and study two year in Barcelona at OADA, which is a very good uh, uh, recognized uh, school in in, in Spain. So it will give you um, an experience to different European countries, or you can go to uh, another uh, campus of schema um, to study. Okay. You see, four year of studies for different uh, campuses. You can go to schema campuses, or you can go to a partner university to meet your uh, third year. For example, you see one mobility track or two uh, mobility mobility track, of course. For example, I will take an example. You have to do your first and second year in France. The third year, you must go or you can go to do uh, an international track. Well, and I, I advise you to do. Can I continue? Please. Uh, you can do your third year in uh, schema campuses in United States, China, uh, Africa, Dubai soon. And the fourth year, you must join the campus where is your specialization. For example, you, we have 13 specialization. For example, if you want to do corporate finance, you have to go to Sofia Antipolis fourth year. It's mandatory. If you want to do, um, for example, global business, you have to go to uh, Belo Horizonte, or if you want to study international business, fourth year, the fourth year, you must go to Raleigh campus. I always say the global BBA, it's for students who wants to do an international career. And after four year bachelor, you'll have a four 
four year degree, uh, um, of course, are recognized by the French Ministry of Education in France. And after you can join immediately your uh, professional life, you don't need to do a master in France after our uh, BBA to uh, to join your prof to your professional life. So this is what I can do. The eligibility uh, of the students, um, you have to do for four year four year studies, eight months of internship. Most of the time, students do the internship between May and August because after you have to start your courses for one year. And uh, of course, uh, I would say the this is up approximately um, things of the BBA. Uh, Ninety percent of our students um, are international, of course. Uh, they work in international most of the time. Uh, they have international jobs. The average of salary and, of course, 50% of students pursue with a master after. But you are not obliged if you just want to work one or two two years and come back after to do your master degree. You, you, you can do it, of course. Uh, this is a uh, schema uh, BBA ranking. It's uh, third uh, best BBA in France and I would say in Europe today. And of course, this is uh, how we join uh, BBA. You must uh, apply online for like all the schema programs and you have to send uh, all the documents that uh, are requested and you will have uh, 20 minutes of interview with a program director. And of course, you have here uh, tuition fees for one year program and application uh, uh, fees. Do you have any question? Um, not uh, really, but thank you so much for this information. Thank you. Yeah. You're welcome. Had a up earlier from somebody called Shiva Shata. I don't know if you're there. Yes. Somebody called Shiva Shepatun? He has put this question in the chat. Oh, there we go. There we go. Go ahead. Okay. So, Sepra says, does Schema Business School Paris campus provide MS in supply chain management and purchasing program? The program exists, but it's in our Lille campus. Why Lille copies this program? It's very important to know. It's very strategic because all the companies of supply chain are at Lille. And uh, we put this program there because uh, it will be easier for students to find internship for this program. Yeah, okay. just to uh, you know, let you know that uh, Lille is only 55 minutes away from Paris. So yeah. even if you want to, you know, it's possible for you to do um, same day back. If you have an interview in Paris, you want to travel to Paris, you want to do a weekend in Paris, uh, you know, you can go because of the proximity. Lille, again, is only one hour, 20 minutes uh, from London, I guess, 30 minutes from uh, Brussels and 55 minutes from uh, Paris. So very well uh, located. Uh, city and the cost of living is lesser than uh, Paris. All right. So can we just cover about the cost of living, the standard of living, and how much the student needs to be ready with the total amount uh, when they're looking to get an admission to schema business school? Okay. <clears throat> so as I said, um, for example, in Paris, the rent is around 800 euros per month, and you will want to add around 200 euros to eat. Um, then transportation and if you want to do things aside you need more than about a thousand and one hundred or two hundred euros per month to live um, in Lille as uh, Viragi said um, it's cheaper it's around 550 and 600 euros per month and uh, same price to eat but the rent difference is quite important per month so that means you need less than um, around a thousand euros um, per month to live. That's the difference between Lille and Paris. Thank and you. I would say that, uh, like the train to go from Lille to Paris is around fifty euros back and forth. So, if you want to come to Paris, often you can, and it will be less expensive to live in Lille, for example. Oh, that's great. Thank you so much. Thanks. Um, so, are students are students allowed to work whilst they're studying? 
Yes. Yes, of course. Indeed. In France, students are allowed to work, as uh, Lauriane is saying, 20, yeah, 20 hours. 20 hours per week maximum. That means around 960 hours per year. Um, however, you need to know that you need um, the French health insurance system in order to, to work. And it takes about one month to get an official number. Um, and then, as I said, yes, you can have um, uh, you know, a student job apart from the courses. But for example, in Paris, you will need to think about the commute time from a home to work to um, to campus, for example, and it takes a lot of time to commute between the three and you still need time to study. So yes, you can work, you can work during the weekends. Um, a lot of Indian students work in restaurants, for example, um, but you need to think about, you know, um, um, having a balance between uh, study and, and work. And to learn French. And trust me, don't <laughs> say it's it's difficult because I'm going to say you something. I I was not speaking French 20 years ago. I came to France. I didn't know how to say hello. I didn't know to say not, any word in French. And my language and French language are very, very different. So I learned. Trust me, I learned. With a lot of motivation, we can do it. Of course, of course, of course. <laughs> Um, one last question. For employment, is there a minimum wage in France? So, yes, there is a minimum wage. Um, Bidagi, I think, was more informed about it than me. Yeah, I think it's uh, nine euros per hour brut, uh, gross. Then it depends. Thank you very much. About nine euros per hour. Sure. Right. And of course, the student never work without contract in France. Never. You should have a contract. That's very important because you have, if you have an accident in your work or something, you will be covered. So that's very important to know, even for student job. We give tips to students. So you see, you, it's very important yes, to listen. Absolutely. Uh, we have a question from Lakshmi Prabha. Yes. How can I know about the Master's in Fashion Business Management and Fashion Luxury Brand Management program or any program related to a fashion? Yes, we have a luxury fashion management, which is based in uh, Sofia Antipolis. We have two programs in luxury. We have luxury fashion management and we have global luxury management. The global luxury management, I was saying that it's... Uh, it's uh, it's uh, one semester in New York and one semester in Paris. And for the luxury fashion management, of course, uh, I will send to uh, to Imali all the information and she can give you uh, the brochure specialized for this program. And if you have any question, of course, I am available or and Viragi to answer to all the questions. Thank you, thank you. Um, it's now coming up to about an hour now. Um, if we have exhausted questions, I would like to come to an end now and like to thank everybody who has participated, including the participants who have asked questions. Um, very, very thankful for you because it also helps other students who may also consider having that same question but not sure how to ask it and we've kind of answered it for you. So it's always helpful to other students as well. So thank you. Is there any last questions before we bring this webinar to a close? Uh, Vinod, before that, we need to show them the slide of how are the applications supposed to made through us. Yes, of course. I will send to Imali and she will send to you the, the presentation, no problem. And if yeah. you have a question after about the presentation, you have now um, my email, so don't hesitate to uh, to contact me. Yeah, we have questions coming in, but uh, we have a process where our students will fill in our application form, and that's how our counselors will guide them to then to an admission to Schema Business School. Thank you. We will could, you okay. could you bring up that link, please? Yes. Although everything is available on our website, Okay. We actually have a link where students can download an application form, an inquiry form, and then that allows us to connect with the student and build that profile 
and then understand what courses and students are able to go forward with. So we actually have that information already. So here oh, we go. Good. Actually use your phone right now and take a picture of the QR code. Great, this technology, isn't it? Or <laughs> if you want to copy the link, uh, www.educateme, uh, you can do that. And then that will take you to the form. You need to fill the form out. There is an example of the form. It's very basic questions. And then, of course, on the back end of that, our, our counselors would then get in touch with you first thing uh, tomorrow morning, because in India, it's now eight o'clock in the evening. Oh. Uh, so they are about to go and have their dinner and enjoy themselves. And then, ha and then tomorrow morning, they'll be active and we'll be uh, calling you back, okay? Bon appétit. <laughs> <laughs> we know there's one student who just posted one query in here. So can you sure, sure, sure. answer? It's uh, Mohamed Noman. Can you tell me about the courses available in your university? My specific interest is in international logistic and supply chain management business analytics. Yeah, I think we've just had that question earlier from uh, Mohammed. Yes, did we? So uh, I believe we've already I... answered that. So uh, go ahead, please. Maybe Alifia, uh, I don't know if I pronounce good your, your name. I can send you uh, for each program uh, yeah. the important information for all MSc program. And I can send you, of course, the link where you can find all the brochures for each program detail really, and uh, you can share that with your students. Okay. And if they have a question, do not hesitate after to come back and to write me for uh, any kind of information to Viragi or me, of course. Yeah, so I also shared a counselor's number of students. Please take a screenshot of their number and they start working from 10 to 6 p.m. in the evening. Feel free to call them tomorrow. Uh, no man, you can share your contact number and email ID with me directly. I'll make sure your counselor will give a call to you tomorrow if you're comfortable in doing that. Right. And sometimes so, we do um, so, uh, sometimes we do webinars with the program directors. So I can give you this uh, information to um, Alifia, and uh, she can uh, share this with uh, your team or with students if they want to hear what the program director is uh, saying. Biragi is doing webinars with the program directors for different programs. So maybe we can invite students to to come and to hear uh, and to ask uh, questions directly to the program program director who is more, uh, I would say, specialized in the field. So don't hesitate to ask us. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, lastly, um, a copy of this presentation will be available from tomorrow on our website. So if any of you want to go through any last slides, anything unsure of, you can always go back and forth going through the slides, OK, and the presentation. Uh, once again, thank you, everyone. Uh, thank you. From France, and goodbye thank from you. United Kingdom. <laughs> <laughs> thank you very much. Have a nice thank evening you. and bon appétit. Thank you, thank you everyone. Thank you. thank you all. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.